Guys, I did some building off camera. Wait, no, never mind. I actually did some building on camera. And here's the time lapse for it. So, I hope you guys enjoyed that pretty long time lapse, but we got the entire second layer done, so that is looking absolutely amazing. And I am actually kind of surprised that I got all of this building done because my BrickLink order just arrived on Monday, so that was February 1st. So I only had like four and a half days to build this, and I got it all done. But if we take a quick look around, yes, the all sides are completed and now the chariot is sitting up there all happy and it is very difficult to fit this thing into one shot so I think that looks pretty good there with the chariot so now all we have left to do is these massive support structures and also the heart and now I just received word on the heart from Corvus that he will not be releasing the heart like instructions until the summer so I'm going to have to build my own, so it's probably not going to be as good as Corvus's design, but obviously it's better than waiting until summer. So sadly, that's a little bit more work for me, but hopefully we can get a good looking heart up in basically where that chair it is. Oh, and another thing like concerning the heart, I did fit the speaker up in here like very, very well. It fits in there like perfectly. So you can kind of see the black tip of it there. But yeah, that speaker is going to bring this mock to life as soon as it starts playing like the heart beat beating heart sounds. So that's going to be really, really cool. And since it is a wireless Bluetooth speaker, I can just like have like a five hour or two hour video of just like a heart beating. And then it will just play that for two hours or whatever. And so I won't need any like wires to connect it up. And as for the lights, I am not going to have them all like turn off like one by one as they would in Mumbo's base because it would be a little bit difficult to do. And also I'm thinking that if I had all the lights lined up, 
a lot of light would bleed into like the other i guess like these orange brick parts so it would kind of all like all the light would like come in together so then if just the bottom one was lit then it also probably looked like the second from the bottom and the third from the bottom was also lit so i'll probably just have them all light up and i think that will look just as good but again if you guys want me to go ahead and try and get everything like specifically in there and i do have like a partial plan of how I would slowly turn them off. It involves an Arduino, so I could definitely do that, but I'm not going to unless you guys want me to, so make sure you leave a comment. But man oh man, this is looking really really cool, and it is a lot of building that I did now that I'm looking at it. It's basically just as much as the bottom layer. Oh yeah, and one more thing. I am absolutely chuffed a bit yes guys we now have a mumbo jumbo minifigure now let's see if i can actually get this to focus on him so there is our mumbo jumbo minifigure so he has an enderman head and just a black torso and black legs and i have to thank e angel 80 for this or or for bringing it to my attention um, that this other YouTuber named Hermit Brick actually made a tutorial on how to make a custom mumbo jumbo. So they had like these prints that you printed off and then I just glued them to the Lego bricks and I know that's like kind of an evil thing to do to Lego, but I thought I do want my own mumbo minifigure and I thought it would be super cool to have it and you can see like the eyes of the Enderman sticking out just a little bit, but I think it is fine considering that this minifigure is basically completely free to me. So I mean, how cool is this? Now I can put Mumbo Jumbo right there on the mock. And that, that just, that's, that's what completes the mock right there. And so I guess I should ask you guys, where should we put Mumbo in this mock? I was thinking we should maybe put it up there on the chicken. So like there, something like that. That could be kind of funny or maybe even put him down near the bottom here. So stick him down there and that could be really cool as well. So let me know where you want the Mumbo Jumbo minifigure, but I think it's just so cool that we now have a Mumbo Jumbo minifigure. Because I mean, that guy right there is what completes this entire mock. Hey, I should maybe even have like a little bubble saying I'm chuffed to bits. That could be funny as well. So with this, we are reaching the end of the episode. And hopefully next episode, I can start designing the heart and then maybe even build some of it and get it up there. Or maybe even build like the bottom part of the like those big structure pillars and get that going as well. So we got a lot of building done in this episode. It's actually kind of a mega episode. But if you did enjoy, please leave a like. And if you're not subscribed, make sure you do that. And with that said, Gigahertz Productions out. <laughs>